Now that Harry Rilling has secured the Democratic Party's nomination for mayor, his next step is getting all sides of that party in his corner. I believe that everybody wants um, the same result in November. Following an unprecedented primary with four candidates from the same party, Rilling says he is confident he can get his opponents, Vinny Mangiacopra, Matt McClave, and Andy Garfunkel, to stand by him. We're going to sit down together and talk about the uh, agenda for the party for the coming election. We all had pretty much the same ideas, but from a different perspective. And we want to share those ideas so that we can put together the strongest message for the city in November. Tuesday night, Rilling's opponents were unsure how they would proceed. I certainly believe that there's, uh, you know, we'll have dialogue over the next few days. I have to consider what I want to do and where I want to be right now. But Rilling says he's been assured they are supporting him. They said they were. Uh, and I have no reason to think uh, otherwise. Rilling says he expects to incorporate some of his opponent's policies into his own. We look at the best ideas, we choose from them, and then we make an agenda and we prioritize the things that we feel are most important to do quickly because I'd rather have people criticize me for moving too quickly than have them criticize me for not moving quickly enough. And as far as what those ideas might be? It's a little, pre a little premature right now. I think we have to sit down and have the discussion. Um, we need to dig a little deeper into uh, how, what, what their uh, idea is and what, what, how they look at it. No matter how you slice it, Rilling says to beat Mayor Richard Moshe November 5th, the Democrats need to stick together. We have to have a unified party. We have to show solidarity. Mike Peel, it's relevant.com.